Hey all, it's Pastor Joseph here. Hey, I know it's been a frustrating summer where we haven't been able to do anything that is youth related. Um, we haven't been able to go to BBX. We had to cancel different youth group events. Even when we tried to plan something, we ended up having to push it off. I know it's frustrating and you've probably been pretty bored. Well, I do have a youth event game that you can do at any time. There's no special day. You can go as soon as you see this video, you can pick a time. But I would tell you, go with your parents, go with your family. They don't have to be youth age. The whole family can get involved on this um, because A, you're gonna need someone to drive you. Um, and, uh, and B, it's just a fun thing to do as a family and uh, still a way for you as a youth to win a few prizes. Here, I got turned on to something, it's called geocaching. It is a lot of fun. Apparently, people have been doing this for like 10 years now. There's boxes hidden around the entire planet, all right? There's a bunch hidden around here in Scottsdale and all over Phoenix. And what it is is that there are these, uh, they could be these little containers, could be what it was called a micro, which is really small, or it could be a size of a pill bottle, or it could be an oil toy can, or even just a small, like a Tupperware box. And they're hidden in various places and there's clues to go try to find them. And it's real easy clues, real easy terrain. Uh, my boys were able to do it. It's simple, all right? So I got thinking, I said, hey, this would actually be fun as kind of a little youth event that I would challenge you on. So what I did is here in Scottsdale, South Scottsdale, I picked out four geocaching boxes. And in Mesa, I picked out four uh, geocaching boxes. And uh, don't worry, you're gonna get the names and titles of them where I hid my business card. Now on the business card, I actually have written up right in here um, a little number and that particular number will get you a prize. Now there's three in each box, unless someone else took them, don't worry about that. But if they, uh, if they're, if it's still in the box, you can get, pull it out, take a pick one, take a picture, text it to me, you'll see the number right down here, text it to me that number uh, uh, and showing that you found it. You can also text me if you need a little bit of a clue. In some places were a little bit difficult and I did take pictures that I would send to you as a hint, if the geocaching hint didn't, didn't, didn't uh, uh, help you at all. However, to play this game, first thing you gotta do is to download to your phone the geocaching app. Watch this little video to see how. To get the geocaching app, you just need to go to your Play Store, whether you have an Android or an Apple phone, just whatever app where you buy other apps. Type in geocaching, download, open up, and register your name or your avatar name. You will see that a map pops up and it will show you your location and your geocachings around it. The green ones are for everyone. That's where you will find Pastor Joseph's business cards. Don't worry about the gray ones, unless you want to get the premium and play, play it on your own. Click on the green one. It will show you many different things, such as navigation on how to get from your location to the geocache. It can also give you hints. Once you find the geocache, hit the log, so that way you can let people know that you found this particular one. Now that you got the app downloaded, now you're ready for geocaching. Have fun. All right, now that you got this app on your phone, it is really quite simple. If you go look on Facebook or if you email me, I'll send you the list and look for the different geocaching boxes. I have them listed. You might have to look around. You're gonna see a bunch of green ones pop up, little boxes everywhere around the map pop up and you, you could take your time and look for them or you could probably search it. Now that's up to you to let you figure that out. Now, once you find the geo box that I've hidden the cards on, I will give you that title. You go, you find it, you find the card, you take a picture of it, you text it to Pastor Joe, and then Pastor Joe will tell you which prize you won. Now, they're not gonna be cheap prizes. They're not like little like, yay, you won this stupid little McDonald's toy. No, no, no. I got Amazon cards various denominations, Starbucks cards, uh, you know, um, Jamba Juice cards. I got, trust me, it will be worth the, the hunt, all right? You are welcome to find them all, all right? There is eight in all, four in South Scottsdale and four in Mesa, all right? If you find all eight, your name will be entered into a grand prize, all right? I'm not gonna tell you what it is because it is a mystery. So, here you go. How do you play the game again? First, you download the Geo app, all right? Geocaching app. Two, all right? 
you go look for the geocache app, you look at the list that I said, hey, here's four in Scottsdale, here's four in Mesa, figure out which ones you want to do with your family. Now make sure you do this with your parents' permission and you know what? Get your parents involved and your family involved. It's something they can all do. Then three, when you find the business card, pick one of them out, take a picture of it, send it to me and I'll tell you which prize that you won. Now, just in case you go to one and you find it and you know it's the one that, that I, I have listed and all my cards are gone because people are allowed to take things out and trade them off, that's okay. Take a picture of it. I know what it looks like and you'll still get entered with a prize, okay? So, you know, not all is lost. So have fun with this. It's gonna be a great, it'll be a great time and we'll still try to figure out some more things to do before school uh, kicks up. But uh, happy hunting and I look forward to seeing who finds what.